It doesn't matter what time you wake up. It matters what you do with the time while you're awake. I used to be a huge proponent of the 5 a.m. club, but what I realized over time is it wasn't necessarily that I need to get up 5 a.m. and meditate and work out my body and, and work on my mind. It was the fact that it was a tool to create a new habit, to create discipline, to create consistency in my day. Starting my day with some consistency and discipline and structure helps build that throughout the rest of the day. And when you start building that early in the day, it carries over to the rest of the day. And then when you stack a day, it becomes weeks and then weeks become months and months become years. <clears throat> As I built that architecture and structure in my day, I slowly realized it didn't matter if I woke up at 4.30 in the morning to start this routine. I could start at seven, do the routine, or I could start to take that framework and start to work and apply that framework to other important aspects of the day. Maybe I need to start writing first thing in the morning to brain dump. Maybe I need to move my body. <clears throat> Regardless of what it is, it's keeping that consistency and that structure in the beginning of your day so that you can continue to move on. Don't wake up, look at your phone, get caught in scrolling. It just rattles the mind. I know I've gotten caught into it. It doesn't serve you for the rest of the day. It creates a lot of anxiety. Now you're like, well, I didn't get anything done. I need to get on this. And then your attention is being required for other things. Now your day is not yours anymore. But getting up early to get what you need done first thing in the morning is the primary premise of the 5 a.m. club. Look after what you need to get done, structure your day so it's more, so that it's better utilized throughout the day.